guys, I think we lost them for... Wow! You lost them for wow? What is that? Oh. Wow. It's like we're at the edge of the world. Actually, we seem to be at the corner of it. Welcome to the Far Lands, my friend. I'd feel a lot better about going into this crazy wall thingy if I wasn't still hungry. At least Jesse found those potatoes. That might be the saddest sentence ever uttered. <laughs> Quite a sight, isn't it? Stretching skyward in all its glory. So what am I looking at here, exactly? This is a natural phenomenon intersection of two of the great walls that form the boundary of our world. Very few have seen it in person. Feeling kind of overwhelmed right now. Ivor really went out of his way to make sure he'd never have visitors, huh? He was always secretive. It was both his weakness and his strength. Whatever Ivor is hiding in here, it will be extremely well guarded. This way, I suspect. I'd feel better about this if Axel and Lucas were here. Come on! Is this... a maze? It would appear so. A massive one, from the looks of it. If Ivor used the command block to build this, it could hold unspeakable peril. Why do I have a bad feeling about this? Because some part of you still knows Ivor. Unfortunately, this seems to be the only way forward. There has to be another way. A secret door, or, I don't know, some way around. There's no way we're going into some crazy maze that Ivor built to keep people away. We'll find some other way through. Best decision you've made all day. Ivor needs to take better care of this place. Flowers, but no trees. Guess it's a farlands thing. Huh. We can probably climb these. Everyone! On guard! There's too many! We can't fight them all! Who needs to climb when you have a potion of leaping? Guys, climb the vines! Well, that worked, I suppose. Yeah, I guess. But now what do we do? We're all separated. Let's just head that way and find a place where the pads connect. Sure hope they don't get lost in there. I hope I don't get lost in there. Hey, that must be Ivor's lab. Wish it was a little closer.
I first met Ruben near a waterfall like this. I hope the little guy's okay. Safe to say, the far lands are strange. Olivia! see a way across. Looks like Ivor kept some redstone dust handy. And a slime ball. Huh, redstone blocks, some pistons. Wonder what this thing's supposed to be. 
anyone? Olivia, is that you? Jesse, there you are. <coughs> I thought I'd never find you. Any sign of the others? Not yet. This maze? We don't have time for this. Who even knows where the others are by now? I mean, the clock's ticking here, Jesse. Well, at least we're back together. Yes, the Dream Team reunited. <laughs> now the Dream Team's just gotta find a way across this gaping bottomless pit. What about this thing? Could it get us across? It's some kind of flying barge. It would probably get us to the other side, but it's in really bad shape, and it's really complicated. You can fix it though, right? I don't know. I think it's out of my league. I wish I'd had more time to study with Eligard. Come on, you'll figure it out. You know you always do. <sighs> Fine, I'll take a look. layout doesn't even make any sense. What was Ivor thinking? Or maybe it's just me. I mean, Eligard herself said I don't have what it takes to be a great engineer. She was right, I just can't hack it. I might as well be a carrot farmer. Who cares what she said? I do. She was the greatest redstone engineer ever. She was in the Order of the Stone. Sure, but the Order are still people, just like us. Right. Just like us. I mean, how are we the ones saving the world when even they don't have what it takes? Soren and Ivor are always at each other's throats. The greatest warrior in history has wither sickness. All I ever see Magnus do is argue, and we both know what happened to Eligard. The Order can't do this. How are we supposed to? How are we supposed to do anything? We're nobody. All I know is the world is depending on us. And maybe the world is in trouble. I mean, they defeated an Ender Dragon. Can you name even one thing we've done right? And I don't mean managing to stay alive. Something that actually matters. Well, we won that building contest at Endercon. That was a contest, Jesse. Right, and the competition was stiff. Just think what we can do when there's nobody even watching. I like that way of looking at it. Ah, all right. I'll try it one more time. Wait a second. I think I see what he was trying to do. Jesse, take this piston, craft it into a sticky piston, then place it on the other side of the barge, along with a redstone block. You got all that? I think so. Sooner the better. Okay, let's put the redstone block where it's supposed to go and place these pistons. and steel to get it started. I'm proud of you, Olivia. Thanks, Jesse. And thanks for everything you said just before. It really helped. No problemo. <laughs> this way! This way! Run! <laughs> Go! 
Go, go, go! Quick, onto the barge! Jesse! That was close. Everyone okay? For the moment. Slime! I'm remembering something with slime. And ch chickens. Or maybe they were ducks? There was a big gathering of people. Yes, we used slime to break a chicken machine. There were chickens everywhere. Weird. Yeah, I kind of remember. Wait. Ugh, it's already fading. Fading. And... Gone. Take my advice, Petra. Some stories are better left forgotten. That was amazing. Get it? Amazing? Tinkering with the Far Lands is nothing to laugh about. Let's go see what he's hiding in there. One person need this many books. We should be careful. This place could be booby trapped. Let's just start looking for the enchanting book. How to train your slime. The various uses of mushroom stew. Potionology, Volume 24? None of these are enchanting books. A Brief History of Cubism. Crafting for Noobs, Revised. A Collector's Guide to Precious Gems. None of these seem to be enchanting books either. Olivia, any luck? Not really. Ivor has too many books, and there's too few of us looking. How did we end up all split up like this? I feel like we're spreading ourselves too thin. I miss how things used to be. That first night we all spent together? Lucas left because he had to. He said he owed it to his friends. I get that. I'd do the same thing for you guys. For the right price, of course. Of course. What's the point of friendship if it doesn't pay? See? This is why we get along so well. Find anything yet? Huh, in this mess? Uh, it's as though Ivor learned nothing from my lectures on organizational methodology. If only he hadn't gotten lost in that confounded swamp. He could just tell us where the book is. Coming here was his idea. He should be here for it. We don't need Ivor. We can find this book on our own. Ha! <laughs> in this mess? Are you mad? There's neither rhyme nor reason to how these books are stored. Finding anything here is impossible. Tedious, maybe. Impossible? No way. Fine, I will continue this monotonous search. But I reserve my right to grumble about it. It's a deal. Twenty thousand blocks under the sea. Learn to succeed by thinking inside the box? I think I'm in the wrong part of the house. All these potions, uh, arranged just so, it seems familiar somehow. We stole a potion from Ivor, didn't we? Around when the chicken thing happened? It's foggy, but I can kind of see it. That's what started this whole mess, stealing that potion. Because of that, when the wither went crazy, Ivor didn't have any way of disabling it. I don't remember that part. Harsh potions, stinky potions. Ivor's got everything except a potion for memory. 
Jesse, am I gonna be okay? Every time I think I'm getting better, it all just slips away again. Of course you will. Sooner or later, it will all come back. Thanks, Jesse. I really needed that. Even if you are just telling me what I want to hear. Wood planks, those will be useful. Hey, Olivia, I think there's some redstone over here. Looks like a circuit. We probably just need a lever to power it. Too bad I don't have one. Yeah, no lever, no functioning circuit. Ruben, what are you doing? <coughs> yeah, well, you're gonna get yourself cooked. I've told you before, stay away from lava. <coughs> First, I'll need some sticks. Okay, got the sticks. There we go, good old-fashioned lever. Like it was made for it, which it was. Let's see what this sucker does. Way. Cool! Why would you build a secret passage in a house that nobody ever visits? More like, why wouldn't you? Secret passageways are cool. Good point. What the? Are you guys okay? We're fine. But the lever isn't working anymore. Stay there. We'll head down and see what we can find. Whoa. What is all this? Huh. Incredible. He's gathered them all in one place. Gathered what exactly? The treasures of the Order of the Stone. Stories I could tell about these dusty old things. I don't see any enchanting books, though. Maybe through there? Uh, locked, of course. There must be some way to open it. These gas tears? They're super hard to get. You don't know the half of it. It was our first official mission as the Order of the Stone. We fought those ghasts for hours, and these tears were our reward. Wow. 
Jesse, what are you doing? Uh, taking this really cool, rare item. We might need it to unlock that door. Oh, very well. Just be careful with it. See? Am I crazy, or is this a sea lantern? Ah, the very same one the Order built all those years ago. We were so green back then. It looks just as bright as on the day we crafted it. A sea lantern, huh? So where'd this packed ice come from? Well, we brought it back from the Ice Plains Spikes biome. It was colder there than anywhere we'd ever been, but <laughs> Magnus slipped so many times our laughter kept us warm. After that, we knew we were ready to face the Ender Dragon. Ooh, cold and slippery! Soren, is this the actual Ender Dragon egg? Huh, alas, yes. The only thing that remains of our final adventure together. No way I'm leaving this behind! These are prismarine crystals. You can only get these underwater, right? Precisely. We nearly ran out of oxygen getting these. <laughs> Eligard had to use a spare bucket just to grab a few extra breaths. We used most of these to craft a sea lantern. This is all that remained. Prismarine is such a cool word. Prismarine. Aha! A hopper! Why is Ivor hiding a hopper in his basement? Huh, five slots. Packed ice. Let's put it here. Gassed tears. Let's try them here. The Ender Dragon egg, so cool. Let's try a sea lantern. In you go. Huh? Those were the right objects, but I guess it was the wrong order. Guess that wasn't right. Prismarine crystals. Into the hopper. Yes! You solved it! But how in the world did you know what order to put them in? There were 120 possible combinations! It was all in the order's history. The, the order of the order, so to speak. Nice work, Jesse. On the puzzle, I mean. Not, not the joke. You know, I often give Ivor a hard time, but for all his complaining, his time with the Order clearly meant a great deal to him. Yeah, I guess so. Anyway, let's go get that enchanting book. By the stars, the Ender Dragon, with replica Ender Crystals and all. Wow, I always wondered what it looked like. way out. Soren, what's this thing supposed to be? It appears to be an homage to our battle with the Ender Dragon. Despite his anger, Ivor never stopped being fond of us. <laughs> he was a big part of our team, after all. And these are supposed to be the Ender Crystals? Scale models of them. They were the secret to the dragon's demise. The secret, huh? Maybe you should tell me the whole story. Ah, 
If only you'd been there. It was a fight for the ages. We'd spent weeks preparing for our greatest battle ever. But even so, Ender Dragon was stronger than even I had imagined. I realized that it was drawing strength from the Ender Crystals, and that the crystals had to be destroyed. I hit the first with a perfectly placed arrow. The second I destroyed by launching myself on the shockwave of Magnus's TNT. Using only my strength and my wiles, I steered the foul beast toward the third crystal. I flew the dragon directly toward the final crystal. Only then did Gabriel deliver his famous final blow. Yeah. We became heroes, and eventually, legends. The greatest the world has ever known. That was absolutely amazing. They didn't call us the Order of the Stone for nothing. I wonder if that story will help me solve this puzzle. So Soren rode the dragon, huh? Interesting. Hey, Ruben, give me a boost, will ya? the book. Wait, aren't those the Ender Crystals? Like, the real ones? No, it, it can't be. Not here. Not after all this time. But those things were destroyed in your big, heroic battle with the Ender Dragon. Right, Sora? I kept them. The fool actually kept them. He looked me in the eye and swore he was going to dispose of them. Sorry, what is all this? What in the world is going on here? Jesse, this isn't... this isn't what it looks like. Our story, uh, the story, it's, it's mostly true. I swear, I swear it. Whatever you're thinking, I promise I can explain. Sorry, have you been lying all this time? No, no! Not exactly. I'm afraid I haven't been honest with you, Jesse. We did defeat the Ender Dragon, but it wasn't exactly like I said. How not exactly? We got rid of it, but we didn't kill it, per se. In fact, we didn't even fight it. Someone just spit it out. What happened? You want the truth? We used that damned command block. You... Used the command block to defeat the Ender Dragon? I'm afraid so. Understand, when I found that blasted block, we were nobodies. But with its help, we became stronger. Faster, we could do so much more. 
The others had no idea what I was doing. Yet the more I used it, the more we came to depend on it. I knew it was only so long before someone would find out. So, I concocted a plan. I would use the command block to blink the Ender Dragon out of existence. Securing our status as legends forever. We told the world we defeated the dragon. Why would you do that? You, you lied, even to your closest friends. All I can say is... I was a fool. So you finally admit it. Soren, how could you? I've How long have you guys been standing there? Long enough that they heard the whole thing. You lied to the whole world? You didn't think you could keep it secret forever, did you, Soren? The truth hurts, doesn't it? You knew about all of this, didn't you, Ivor? Of course I knew about it. I was in the Order from the very beginning. Soren, Gabriel, Magnus, Eligard, they agreed to keep this a secret. And you, you agreed to stay quiet too, in exchange for all of our treasures. <gasps> I've technically never told anybody. Jesse discovered the truth on his own. So this whole thing, the wither you unleashed, it's all been to teach the Order a lesson? To teach the world a lesson. To show you who the Order really are. Liars, cowards. And now, they know. You know, I kind of regret punching you right now. Yes, well, you weren't the first. No one ever seems to appreciate my good intentions. Might have something to do with the casual way in which you've unleashed Armageddon? Look, my wither plan obviously backfired. You think? I didn't know we'd end up with three of those things tearing the world apart. Oh, I almost forgot for a moment. Well, they are. And while we sit around talking about your dysfunctional order of liars, those things are still out there wrecking the world. Jesse's right. Destroying the command block is all that matters anymore. How ironic that the best thing the command block gave us was the very means to destroy it. Spare us the poetry. It's not your strong suit. So the enchanting book, what do we do with it? You craft a weapon, then put it on an anvil. Follow me. I'll show you. Ivor, I'm sorry. About everything. Yes, well, it doesn't matter. Grab some ingredients and craft a weapon. I'll show you how to enchant it. Sweet. Let's see what Ivor's... I don't think I can craft anything with what I have on me. Let's see, there's a bunch of crafting stuff and... Diamond score! So, I can craft an axe. Guess I could craft another sort of pickaxe. We'll leave a goodie. A shovel. A hoe. weapon. Just wait till you enchant it. Let's see what this enchanting book is made of. Behold, my enchanted diamond axe. <laughs> yes, that should do the job nicely. But if you're fighting those wither monsters head on, you'll want better armor too. I enchanted these for the order. They're about as strong as it comes. And TNT. Any preference? I have eight different sets to choose from. Then believe me, they're all excellent. 
All right, let me take a look at them. It's all quite durable and sturdy. They won't stop damage, but they'll help. Some of these were e I call this the Star Shield! No object in the universe can penetrate it. The Adamantine Impervium! Even harder to damage than it is to pronounce! All right, this is the set. Yes, a fine choice. Now go ahead and put it on. How do I look? Ready for action. You can take some for your friends as well. Sounds good to me. armor, Jesse. Thanks. And there's plenty to go around. Now let's get back to Soren's fortress and see how the Witherstorms are doing against those Endermen. 